Today, we're doing a building competition against my friend Bubbles. But little does he know, I'm gonna be using command stick sheet through the entire thing. Do you think he'll catch me? Watch to the end to find out. All right, Bubbles, are you ready for this build challenge? Yeah, I'm so ready. I'm so excited to build. Me too, Bubbles. In this dispenser over here, I put nine random topics that we can build. Whoa, that's so many. So flip this lever and let's see what we get. All right, here I go. We got house. Ooh, house? I'm so good at building houses. Well, I'm better because I actually live in a house. Well, I do too, but what side are we gonna go on? Well, I'm obviously gonna pick my favorite color, blue. Ew, you're choosing blue? Green is definitely way better than blue. Ew, green looks like boogers. I'm gonna go on my side. Alright, whatever you say, Bubbles. We have five minutes to build this house, and time starts now. Bubbles probably thinks I'm building my house right now, but what he doesn't know is that I secretly installed a mod that lets me copy and paste any build in seconds. As you can see right here, my house is now loaded, so all I have to do is type slash paste and oh my gosh look at this in just two seconds a three-story house just spawned right in front of us and oh my gosh it looks so good for some reason this house doesn't have any doors on the front so i'm gonna fix that we'll go inside and place our door and then start filling the outside with wooden plank just like so and i don't know why this cobblestone's right here so we're just gonna get rid of this then replace it with some stairs so it's way easier to get up this looks awesome now for the inside of this house since this entire house is completely empty it's gonna be a bit hard to figure out what to put inside here but i have a plan as soon as we walk through the front door i think we should put a living room here so we'll start off by adding a little couch right here then we can start adding carpet on the floor to make this house nice and cozy i'll alternate between blue and green our favorite colors and wow i already love the look of this and finally what's a living room without a tv i'll start building one right here right by the carpet perfect then we can add some paintings to this wall to make it really look like a tv that should do the trick then we can decorate this area by adding a flower pot flower lantern and some antennas by the side of our tv this actually looks so nice but only the first room is done we still have two more floors to fill in oh no this is not looking good but i still think we can make do we have a lot of room on this floor but i think the first thing we can start off here is with a kitchen the first thing we're gonna put in this kitchen is a refrigerator and to do this it's really simple we'll start off by putting two dispensers right here then adding an iron door right in front of it. Then we'll place a lever to the side of our fridge and then fill it up with all of our favorite food. Now, as soon as you pull this lever, a random food will pop out. We got cake. Now we're gonna make a stove top so we can actually cook all of our food. To do this, I'm gonna put down some spruce planks and slabs. Next, I'm gonna break this slab right here and replace it with a campfire. After that, we're gonna place a block on top of this campfire, put down a rail and then a minecart hopper. Then make sure to break the rail and then the block underneath it and it should fall right into place finally we're gonna put a trapdoor right here put a piston to the side of it and then after we activate this piston boom we have our very own stove top we can cover this part by adding a trapdoor after we're done cooking the food we're gonna need to wash our hands so we're gonna build a little sink we'll break this slab right here and then replace it with a spruce stair then we'll fill the stair with water add a tripwire hook and then our sink is done after all the food is finally prepared we're gonna need a table to eat it at we'll start off by placing down a ton of oak slabs just just like this that should be big enough and then placing some more slabs every other block now that all the slabs are placed down i'm gonna add a banner on the edge of each slab to make it act like a chair just like so and now we're gonna put some food in this table let's add a few bowls put down some food put an egg for good luck and let's put the cake down from earlier and boom just like this our kitchen is complete now i'm gonna turn this area into a bathroom we'll start off by getting rid of this glass and get to work on making our toilet and this is actually really Really easy to make we'll set down a cauldron right here put down a water bucket add a lever on top and then boom our toilet's done but now we have to turn this area into a shower which probably isn't gonna be so easy but i have a plan we'll break these blocks and then put some stairs to the edges just like so and now we're gonna add some wet sponges right here and just like that you can already see that the water is dropping down then we'll put some iron trap doors up here now we just have to place a lever right here break out towards the outside and now we're gonna have to build a redstone tower so we'll place a redstone torch right here a block on top and then just keep repeating this process and now that the redstone's all the way connected we'll just add some redstone dust on top of the sponges and then cover this all up now we can use this lever to open and close our shower at any time and now to finish it all off we'll start by adding some black stained glass all the way on these edges and now we'll finish off by adding some more planks so they won't be able to see the sponges and boom just like that our bathroom is completely done
one. And now that just leaves us with the third floor to take care of. And I think we're gonna turn this into our master bedroom. I'm gonna save this room for bubbles and then turn this room over here into my bedroom. We'll start off by adding a blue bed over here and then putting some blocks to the side of it. We'll add a flower pot on the left and a little nightlight on the right. And then finally, we'll top it off by adding some blue carpet. And wow, we barely built anything and this already looks so cozy. So I think I'm gonna do the same over here. First off, I'm gonna get rid of some of this wood over here so I can really see the view. Next, I'm gonna add my bed here, but before we do that, we gotta add pillows. We'll break some blocks over here, add some banners, and then place our bed. Oh my gosh, this looks so comfy. Now we'll add some blocks to the side and add the same thing, a flower pot and a nightlight. Finally, we're gonna top it off with this cool green carpet design and just like that, our house is done. This turned out amazing and I can't wait to see Bubbles' reaction on this. And the builds are only gonna get crazier and crazier, so make sure to watch to the end. Now, I'm gonna go check up on Bubbles. Hey Bubbles, how's your build going? My build's actually going really good. I'm already finished. You're finished? Well, in that case, we should go and see each other's build. Oh, I'm so down. All right, Bubbles, how about we see your house first? Sounds good, because first is the best. Oh my gosh. Okay, this actually looks pretty cool. Yeah, isn't my house so nice? It is, even though it is a bit on the smaller side. Small? It's huge. Oh, uh, I don't know about that. Just wait till you see mine. It's probably way smaller than mine, but okay, let me show you around. Let's see it. Okay, so you first walk over this super cool pathway to the front door, and look at this sign it says bubbles amazing best house and we even have some blue torches here to light up the front you you put blue torches i don't know how amazing this house is really gonna be hey what's wrong with blue torches i don't know i think they'd be way better if they were green but whatever show me the inside of the house all right come inside whoa this is so cool yeah isn't it so cozy in here i mean yeah besides all the blue i actually really like this hey there's nothing wrong with blue well look over here to the left over here, I have my own collection of blue plants. Why is there so much blue in your house? Well, at least it's on green grass. Because I love blue, and if I were able to have blue grass, I would do that too. All right, whatever, Bubbles. What else do you have here? And over here, we have a nice TV and a really comfortable couch. Wow, this is pretty cozy. Yeah, I watch Bubbles and GE on this TV all the time. And then come over here, I have a little mini kitchen, and we have some food in here cooking. Here, you can have some. Oh, wow. Thank you, Bubbles. But wait, what's on the second floor? Oh, you're in for a surprise. This is our bedroom. Wow, you even placed a green bed for me. Thank you so much, Bubbles. Yeah, and just so it doesn't get confusing, on this sign, I have arrows pointing to which bed is ours. Cool, and we can even see the view from out here. Yeah, isn't it so nice? Wow, I must say, Bubbles, I'm actually pretty impressed with your house. Yeah, I worked really hard on it. I can tell. Is there anything else you want to show me? Yeah, there's one last thing I want to show you. Look in that chest, and there's a little surprise for you. All right, let's see what it is. Ooh, an emerald. Let me go pick this up. Geez, smelly. Wait a second. Why did you call the emerald that? Ha, ah, you're smelly, GE. I am not smelly, and for that, I might have to take off some points. Well, it's definitely worth it, because I was able to call you smelly. All right, whatever, Bubbles. All right, GE, so what would you rate my house out of 10? I'm not gonna lie. I'm actually really impressed with your house, Bubbles. I didn't know you were this good at building. Yeah, I'm quite the professional. Given all that, I think I'm gonna have to to give this house a 7 out of 10. Yay, let's go, 7 out of 10. All right, but just wait until you see my house. There's no way your house is better than mine. All right, Bubbles, I'm gonna drop the wall in 3, 2, 1, and this is my house. What do you think, Bubbles? Whoa, I didn't expect it to be this big. I gotta show you around, Bubbles. Follow me. So right over here, we have the front door, and as soon as we go in, we have our nice little living room with a couch and a TV. Whoa, this couch is so nice it's so comfortable and wow this carpet's great too it's a mixture of green and blue just like us i know bubbles and over here we have access to the storage area and we have a little entrance to the backyard look i can even see your house over there whoa it's like we're neighbors wait but why don't you have any plants in your backyard oh i don't know i didn't really have enough time to place it down i mean i guess there is a lily pad do you have anything else you want to show me yeah we have two more floors to this house follow me two floors as soon as we go up these stairs we have our little kitchen right here with a stove, sink, and fridge. Whoa, this stove is so cool. How did you make this? You can see how I made it by opening.
opening this trap door. We have a fireplace, minecart, and trap door. Wow, you're actually pretty good at building, GE. This is really cool. And what? Your fridge has enchanted golden apples in them? Yup, and as soon as you get your food, we can eat it right here at this table. Wow, this is such a treat. I know, right? And I think I'm gonna start eating this cake. Ooh, this cake looks really yummy. After we're done eating, we can make our way over to the bathroom right here where we have a toilet and a working shower. Come on, try it out, Bubbles. Wait, but the shower is out in the open. Everyone can see me. Oh, uh, I guess you're right. I didn't really think about it. But on the bright side, if we flick this lever, it actually works. Whoa, it's actually working. Do you see this, GE? Yup, the water's dropping down from the sponge. And this is why I'm not smelly and you're smelly. All right, whatever, Bubbles. I use this shower first. Yeah, whatever. Is there anything else you want to show me? Yup, we have one more floor to go through. So if we go up this ladder, we'll make our way to our bedroom. Whoa, this bedroom is so sick. It's all the way up in the air. Yup, as you can see by the color, this is your bedroom. I made sure to add a little blue plant over here too. Wait, I didn't even notice that. This is a blue bed, blue carpet, blue flower. It's all mine. Yup, and then if we make our way over here, we have my bedroom. Hey, why do you get a bigger bed than me? Well, it's my house, silly. I mean, I guess... It does look really nice, though. Yup, and we have a really nice view over here, too. Whoa, but isn't this a little bit dangerous? As long as you don't get too close, I think we should be fine. Alright, I'm gonna stay back here, then. But with all that out of the way, what do you think of my house? This all looks really nice, and it's really big, too, but I'm just wondering, how did you build all of this in five minutes? Well, you know me, I'm just a professional builder. Hmm, I don't know if I believe that, but alright. Alright, whatever, Bubbles, but what do you rate my house at a 10? Well, well, I can't lie, this is a really, really nicely built home, so I would have to give it a solid 9 out of 10. 9 out of 10? That means I won! Let's go! Whatever. I'll beat you in the next round. Let's see about that. Alright, Bubbles, on to round 2. I might have won the first round, but there's still two more rounds to get through, so you still have a chance to win. Well, I'm pretty confident, because I'm definitely going to win this one. Alright, well, I guess we can flip the lever. Let's see what we get. Here I go. And we got pirate ship. Oh, I love pirate ships. I don't know about you, but I actually have a yacht in my backyard, so this should be pretty easy. A yacht? How do you have a yacht in your backyard? Uh, uh, I, I don't know. GE, you do not have that much money. All right, fine. I guess you caught me, but we'll have five minutes to build this as well, and the time starts now, so let's get building. I'm gonna win. Luckily for me, I have the perfect build copy and pasted for this one, so I'm gonna get started. The pirate ship is loaded, so I'm gonna paste it right here. And oh my gosh, this thing is huge. There's so much room on this ship, so I'm definitely gonna have to explore it. This is the top deck right here, and we have some stairs that we can get to the bottom. And uh, why are there so much heads just sitting around here? Guys, I actually have no idea why this is here, but you know what? Let's just ignore it. Making our way through the ship, there's just a ton of heads lying around, but there does seem to be some rooms here. So let's check it out. And oh, I guess I was wrong. This is a room to the outside. But what else? does this ship have to offer? Hmm, looks like it's the same thing, but let's see what's at the bottom over here. I guess this is where we store all of our riches. A ton of diamond, gold, and lapis. And look, there's even a ton of chests here as well. I guess the bottom floor is just storage for all the ship. Alright, this ship looks really cool and all, but I think we're gonna have to give it an upgrade, because come on, come on, there's literally blue over here. So we'll start off by replacing this blue with green, and just do that all the way over the ship, just like that. Then we'll replace this lapis with a ton of emerald block and wow this does look nice but we still have the rest of the ship to complete this is gonna take forever if we do it by hand but luckily i have a command just for moments like these we'll type this command right here to replace all the yellow concrete with green concrete just like this and oh my gosh we can keep doing this all the way around the ship now that we have all the concrete done we just have to replace the wool and the gold block and boom just like this we completely replace the outside of this ship but we still need to make some changes to the inside. Now that we're in the storage area, we're gonna completely replace all this lapis with emerald blocks. So we'll just replace all the blocks just like this, and we're almost done. Finally, let's just get this stack of lapis right here, and done. This already looks so much better. And one more thing, you see these diamonds over here? Yeah, we're gonna turn them into emeralds now. Oh my gosh, this ship actually looks so cool. And with that, I'm gonna check up on bubbles now.
now. All right, Bubbles, I'm not gonna lie. It's actually only been four minutes, but I'm trying to look at your boat. Wait, what? The five minutes aren't even up yet. But I mean, I guess you can look at my boat. Well, that's good, because I'm definitely trying to see what you built. All right, well, just come over here. Whoa, that's definitely a boat. Yeah, it's my amazing pirate ship. Don't you like it? I mean, it's pretty small for a pirate ship. I mean, one iceberg and this entire thing's over. Well, hell, we only had a few minutes to build this. There's no way yours is better than mine. All right, whatever. Show me around your boat. All right, so first of all, here's a little bridge to get onto the boat. Okay. And you can read this sign. This is Bubbles Pirate Ship. Wow, I guess this is the real deal here. Yeah, and right when you get on the boat and you go over here, look at this. I have some pirate's gold. Wow, you actually have a lot of gold here. You must be pretty rich. Yeah, I'm one of the best pirates to ever sail the seas. Alright, well, I don't know about that, but what else do you have on this boat? Here's some food for the crew. Steak and carrots, looks good. And here's their sleeping area. I have a crew of four people, so I have made four beds. Nice, and I'm assuming this is the wheel, right? Yep, this is for the captain, which is me. Look at me drive this boat. And last but not least, I gotta show you these cannons over here. Click this lever and see what it does. Alright, let's see. Oh, wow, these cannons actually shoot out fire. Yeah, how do you think I got all this gold? I mean, I guess that makes sense. I'm not gonna lie, Bubbles, your ship is small, but I'm actually impressed. So I'm gonna have to give you a 6 out of 10. A 6 out of 10? Let's go! Now I'm gonna show you my pirate ship, and I can't wait for you to see this. I'm pretty excited too, but there's no way it'll be better than my pirate ship. Alright, Bubbles, I'm gonna take down this wall in 3, 2, 1, look at my boat. What in the world? There's no way! It's huge! Yup, and I made sure to make the outside of this green my favorite color whoa it is really green but i have one question for you ge what why is your boat just floating in midair it's not even on water uh i don't know it's it's like a special kind of boat and it doesn't need any water hmm that's a little suspicious, but... Don't worry about it, Bubbles. Let me show you around. All right. Up here, we have a bunch of heads for some reason, but there's also cannons over here. Whoa, these heads are really scary. Do your cannons work too? Not right now, unfortunately. We're, we've been having some technical difficulties. Hey, these don't even work. This sucks. What? You're so rude, Bubbles. Let me just show you the rest. All right, let's see if you can make it any better. If we go down these steps, it's basically the same thing, but on a much larger factor. Actor. These heads look really scary. Why would you put them there? I didn't know bubbles, but there's way too many heads in the next few floors So we're gonna go all the way to the bottom if we jump down We have some pirates emeralds diamonds and gold. Whoa, this is your treasure room This is so sick. Wow, and I thought I was rich. I know right? I've been saving up for quite a while GE, what's that over there? Oh uh, over there? Uh, I, I don't really know wait I'm taking your gold wait bubbles. You can't do that Ha 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 ha. Give me my gold back. Hi ya. Ah, ah, here you take it back, take it back. All right, this room is cool, but is there anything else to show me? Oh, uh, I actually have no idea, but I guess we can try finding our way around, right? Wait, what do you mean by that? How do you have no idea? Isn't this your build, GE? Oh, uh, I mean, I I I think it is. Yeah. I guess I'm just having some trouble remembering. Hmm. I mean, I guess this build is really big. Are you sure you built this by yourself? Yeah. I definitely built it. What do you mean? I'm a professional builder. I'm just like that. So, Bubbles, what do you think of my pirate ship? This pirate ship is really well built, but there is one thing. The cannons don't even work, so I'm gonna have to give it a 4 out of 10. 4 out of 10? For this giant pirate ship? That's no fair. Well, what's a pirate ship without working cannons? Mm, I guess you're right. That makes the score 1 to 1. Let's move on to round 3. I'm gonna win again. Alright, Bubbles, the score is 1 to 1, which means this round is for all the marbles. All the marbles? Yup, so let's go flick that lever and see what we get. Please be something good. Temple! I've actually never really built these, so I'm looking forward to it. Well, I've actually built hundreds of these before, so I think I'm gonna win. Alright, well, this time around, we have 10 minutes to build because it's the final round. 10 minutes? I'm gonna make this build so good. Alright, good luck, Bubbles. The timer starts now. Little does Bubbles know, this is gonna be our biggest build yet, so let's get right to pasting this. So I have to go really far away from this one because of how big it is. Oh my gosh, it just loaded in, and look at how big this temple is. As you can see in the chat, 
that. It's literally 18 million blocks. There's no way he's gonna believe I built this in 10 minutes. It even goes a little past the walls, but hopefully he doesn't notice. Where do we even start? There's so much to look at. And there's even a little chair and swing that we can sit down and relax in. As we get to the middle, it looks like they built some beacon towers over here. Very cool indeed. That's really cool actually, but I think it'll look even better if we added a beacon right in the middle. But we'll get to that later. For now, I want to check out one of these towers and oh my gosh it looks like they even did the inside too from the looks of it i'm pretty sure this is supposed to be an elevator so let's go up oh my gosh this is actually sick this temple is actually so huge there's no way i don't win this competition and if we go in this bridge over here it looks like they place some more beacons and wow the attention to detail here is absolutely amazing it looks like they placed some trees down here as well wait is that a chicken what how did you get up here guys i have no idea how this chicken just got up here i literally just spawned this temple in comment down below what i should name this chicken the most like comment officially be this chicken's name but after we get past all of these trees it looks like we have an identical building over here but hmm that's weird they don't have an elevator here i actually have an idea on what i'm gonna do with this room but first let's go back to the outside of the temple all these trees and the chair look really nice but i feel like something's missing here so i'm gonna turn this empty space into a fountain first off we're gonna get some crimson stairs to match the theme and then we're gonna start placing it down don't forget to add some blocks over here too and then finish it off with some slabs just like that and now we're already done with the base for our fountain then we'll add some more planks right in the bottom perfect now we're gonna place a block in the middle and then add some steps right around it then we're gonna place another block and then fill the edges with trap doors they're blue so i think bubble should like them now we're gonna go back in with another plank and more stairs then we'll place a sea lantern right here and then you guessed it more stairs this is already looking so nice but there's a few more things we have to do we'll finish it off with some more slabs some walls and some fences just like this and then finally some water in the middle and oh my gosh this looks so nice and it definitely fits in with the rest of the chairs and trees now we're gonna add the beacon i was talking about earlier we'll start by getting rid of all of this then we're gonna replace these blocks with emerald we'll add one more layer right here and then bam let's put this beacon down but it isn't lighting up yet that's because there's some blocks right here that's covering it so let's replace it right now just by breaking all of this and oh my gosh our beacon is finally lighting up this actually looks so cool we can make this beacon even cooler though if we take some green and lime glass pins we can actually place them in the middle of our beacon to change the color of it so i'm gonna place these blocks one by one until we get to the top of the temple and that should be good let's see how this looks oh my gosh this actually looks so cool now that our beacon finished there was actually one more thing i wanted to add you see i've been cheating this entire time and with the occasional slip up i don't think bubbles has noticed so instead of telling him up front i'm gonna give him a challenge for him to figure out and that's where this room comes in we'll start by filling the bottom all the way with lava just like this okay almost done and bam this entire floor is completely filled up next we're gonna get rid of the edges to make sure there's no way for my friend bubbles to cheat we'll get rid of some of this brick too and there we go this entire area area is completely cut out but now we have to build the actual chowling i'm not gonna make it too hard but at the same time i can't be making it too easy either we'll start by making a parkour with these blue diamond blocks all right that looks good and there we go i think our parkour should be done now i'm gonna test it out to make sure it's not too hard for bubbles let's make this first jump right here then the second one right here and wow this is actually pretty easy so far and one more jump before the end i think we're gonna have to change this up a bit and and there we go. The parkour section is complete. After the parkour, I'm gonna make him answer this simple quiz before he gets to the prize. Let's start by making a tiny path right here and then place some doors on each side. And before we put the questions, I'm gonna put this green path down the middle. And so for first question, I put what is the better color, green or blue? Bubbles might think the answer is blue, but little does he know, as soon as he makes it through this door, a pit of lava will be waiting for him right at the bottom. But if he picks green, which is definitely the right answer, he'll be completely safe now we'll add some paintings here so we can't tell which is which and now this will lead us to our next question which is are you subscribed if you pick no way this is gonna lead you straight to your death because why wouldn't you be subscribed the right 
answer this time around is gonna be yes, which will lead us straight to the prize. We'll start adding the prize by adding some gold blocks right here with the chest right in the middle. And we'll place one diamond in the middle. But this isn't just any diamond because if we open the chest right here and hover over the diamond, it says I was cheating the entire time. And this is how Bubbles is gonna figure out I was cheating with the copy and paste mod. So with that all out of the way, I'm gonna check in on Bubbles and see how he's doing. Hey Bubbles, how's your temple going? My temple's looking really good. I'm already finished with it. Wow, you're already finished? Well, let's go check each other's build. All right, Bubbles, I'm really looking forward to see what you just built. Oh, you are not ready for this. I put in so much effort. Come look at this. All right, let's check it out. Oh, is this supposed to be a temple? I'm not gonna lie. It kind of looks more like a bouncy castle. A bouncy castle? No, this is my amazing temple. What do you mean? Read the signs. Welcome to Bubbles Temple. I guess that makes sense, but can you show me around? Yeah, before we go inside, look over here. I have a little pond next to the temple to make it look better. Oh, wow. We have some green trees and lily pads here. Yep. All right. Now let's go inside. All right. Let's check this out. And as you come in, you can see this massive high ceiling temple and a bunch of chests filled with diamonds. Oh my gosh. This is actually so cool. Besides the diamonds part. Well, GE, I figured you would say that. Look at this chest over here. All right. Let's check it out. Emeralds. Oh my gosh. Wait. Thank you, Bubbles. See, I thought everything through. Wow, you really did, but is there anything else? Yeah, just come through these doors over here to the second part, and to my right-hand side, you can see that there's an enchantment table. Whoa, and you have all the bookshelves here, too. Yep, and a bunch of enchantment books in this chest. That's really cool, but what's up these stairs? Well, let me take you up. There's a bunch of stairs, so you're gonna have to use a little bit of leg power. All right, let me power through. Almost there, and here we are. Wow, this is really nice. There's a blue bed and a green bed. Yeah, this green bed's just for you, and I even put a green cactus over here. Aw, thank you. And the best part of this is the view. Stand on the edge here over the fence and look at that view. Oh my gosh, this looks so nice. Yeah, isn't it great? I put so much effort into it. I even have these little bells here that you can ring. Wow, I didn't even notice these. Yeah, see, this is not a bouncy castle, it's a temple. Hmm, I guess I was wrong then. This actually looks really nice. Yep, 10 minutes is a lot of time so I have to make sure that it's perfect. So, GE, what would you rate my wonderful temple out of 10? You know, I actually thought it was really cool, so I guess I'll give it an 8 out of 10. An 8 out of 10? That's almost full points. Let's go! You're right, Bubbles, but you're definitely not ready for what my temple has to offer. It's definitely not going to be better than mine, but let's see it. All right, Bubbles, you know the drill. The wall goes down in 3, 2, 1, and look at my temple. What? No way, GE. Did you really build all of this in 10 minutes? I mean, yeah, it said to build a temple, so I had to go all out for this. This is actually insane. This is huge. Yup, so let me show you around. Sounds like a plan. On the edge of the temple, we have all these trees that you can go through. You can walk through, relax, but as soon as you get to this area, we have a little swing chair and fountain i made sure to add some blue trapdoors just for you too wow i was just about to say that there wasn't enough but since you added the trapdoors and there's blue water i guess it's pretty good this is a really nice swing too look at me Whee! well i'm glad you like it bubbles but i have to show you the rest of the temple yeah this place is massive let's go once we go up this staircase we'll make our way towards the middle which i have a very big surprise Ooh, a big surprise once we go up you can already see the light over here you guessed it we have a beacon whoa this beacon is really cool but i do have one problem with the g what's the problem why is it green well it's my build so i had to put my favorite color in it as well i don't know how i feel about it being green wait what are you doing look at that now we have a little blue piece here all right that's much better all right whatever you say bubbles this is pretty cool though i didn't think of putting a beacon on my build yeah i know right and it goes all the way to the sky whoa wait Wait, GE, why is there lava over there? Lava? I have no idea what you're talking about. You know what? Uh, follow me. Let's go to the next building. That was really weird, but okay. Once we go into this tower, we're greeted with two elevators, one going up and one going down. Elevators? There's no way these actually work. Yeah, they do. Just step in it and we. Whoa, what? No way. All right, that was pretty sick. Yup, and now that we're all the way over here, we can make our way onto this bridge, which, did I mention, it has a lot 
lot of detail to it. Wow, how did you build all of this in 10 minutes? Well, you know me, I'm just a building pro. And once we keep going through here, we have some trees and the beacon from earlier. Wow, this thing really does go up to the sky. Yup, but there's one more thing I want to show you. What, this other tree? Nope, the other tower. If we keep running across, you'll notice that there's some parkour for you to complete. Parkour, I'm really bad at parkour. Don't worry, Bubbles, you got this. And if you look over here, there's even a special surprise at the end. No way, a surprise? Now I definitely got to complete this parkour. All right, then get to it. All right, here I go. I made the first jump. Nice, now you have the rest of these to complete. Wait, there's a bunch of lava down there? You didn't tell me about the lava, GE. Don't worry about it, Bubbles. Just keep doing the parkour. All right, this got a whole lot scarier, but here I go. Nice. Another jump. All right, I'm feeling really good about this. Watch this. I'm gonna do two jumps right here. Oh my gosh, wait. You're actually almost to the end. Wait, I am almost there. I'm gonna make these two jumps, and here I am. And over here, I made a little quiz for you to complete. Just two questions, and you're all the way to the prize what is the better color green blue well obviously it's blue whoa burning i'm sorry bubbles but you chose the wrong choice it's all right though because i'll give you one more chance how is that wrong blue is definitely the better color but since i guess it's your quiz it's probably this answer green so let me go through it and yay i'm on to the next question let's go you have one more question left and then you're all the way to the prize hmm what's this one are you subscribed well obviously i'm gonna have to be subscribing subscribe is the best thing everyone should sub right now let's go you got that one right and if you haven't subscribed yet make sure to click the subscribe button because we're almost at a thousand subscribers but there you go bubbles here's your prize a diamond let's go wait why does it say i was cheating the entire time ge were you cheating bubbles i have something to confess what is it this entire time i was secretly cheating in the competition with the copy and paste mod no way, all of these builds were pasted in? Yup, I want to see how you'd react to such a massive build. Well, yeah, that would explain why all of your builds were so good. But since you were cheating throughout this whole thing, does that mean that I win? I guess so, Bubbles. You win the competition. Let's go. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe. And to watch more of our adventures, click the video on screen right now.